Hey, welcome back to From the Tech Desk by your RC experts here at Horizon Hobby. I'm your host, Brad Brooker. Today, we're going to walk through the steps you need to take to turn your stock shocks on your SCX6 platform into king shocks. So before we start, we need a few items. We need a 2.5 millimeter wrench, wheel wrench, some king shock collars, king lower shock caps, king shock caps. Now let's get wrenching. First thing we're gonna do is take the wheels off the vehicle itself so we get access to the shocks. Next thing to do is remove the shocks themselves. There will be a mount on the bottom, a mount on top. Let's go get the truck out of the way. It's also a good time to grab a towel or a rag if you like to put your parts on as you're working on them. So we'll start taking the shocks apart themselves. Go and grab your king shock parts. We're going to open the bags up. Go ahead and remove the shock collars. Go ahead and take the O ring out of these stock shock collars. Once you have those out, go install them in the new ones. Next, we're going to take the shock ends off the shocks. Now I'll go and take the bottom shock cap off the shock. You want to leave everything on the original shock itself as well. Um, just taking the shock cap off the bottom one. You install the King Heads version. Once you have those all installed, now let's go put the shock collars on. Now let's go and put the shock ends back on the shocks.
Now let's go ahead and remove the actual shock eyelets out to the top here because we'll use that on the King Shocks versions. Next, we'll remove the shock cap and install the King Shock cap on. Good thing to do is actually use your springs themselves to hold the shock in place. You will have to take the bladder out. Now go ahead and put your springs and the retainers on as well to complete the process. There you have it. Now you turn your factory shocks into king shocks. Again, you'll want to use the original eyelets as well um, to install this, but now let's get it installed on the vehicle. Go ahead and grab your truck. Tires to use as a car stand. So we're putting the shocks back on the truck. Make sure you put the red spring shocks in the front, silvers in the rear, and also you want to put a washer on the screw going through the top eyelet um, of the shock as well. So let's go get those all installed. There you go, the shocks have been installed. As you can see them here, have that king shock look now. Now let's go install the tires back on. There you go, that's how you turn your stock shocks into replica king shocks on your Axial SCX6 platform. Thanks again for watching, stay tuned for more tips, tricks, and other videos from your RCX for Survivor's Hobby.